well, for Boston University as they defeat Lafayette by a score of 13 to 9. As you see, the Terriers leaving Fisher Stadium. Mike Ventola with you. And let's take a look at those highlights from today. And I tell you, this was really an entertaining game from the start of the first quarter to where we finished up here at the end of the game. Back and forth in the early going in quarter number one. At one point, it was a 2-2 game before Boston University went on a four-goal streak, taking that into the second quarter until a goal was scored by Gunnar Bogorowski to make it 6-3 to three going into halftime. Coming out of halftime, took quite some time, almost half the quarter, until a goal scored by Matt Bogger to make it 7-3, to three, and then Lafayette scoring two goals back-to-back -to, -back to make it 7-5. to five. Then BU going on a four-goal in a row scoring streak, taking you into the early part of the fourth quarter. But then Lafayette, after trailing 11-5, got goals scored by Cuniff, Lehman, Mathis, and Lehman again to make it 11-9. But then the straw that broke the camel's back was the goal by Ellerton to make it 12-9. And then D'Alto with a cherry on top, making it 13-9. Though you look at the stats, though, and, you know, not too much of a difference outside of the score. I mean, the shots, two, apiece, two different. Shot on goal, three different. All right, the ground balls favoring Lafayette. But then the face-offs, too. How about Lafayette able to win the face-off battle but still unable to win the game? Um, that's something where, you know, especially in lacrosse, you've got to win the face-offs in order to really get a chance to win. But uh, credit Boston University in their defense today. But you look at the leaders uh, with Perfetto and D'Alto for BU. Strong days for them. Cuniff and Dutton also with good days. Cuniff with two goals. He was the leading scorer today um, at 1.4 Lafayette. So that's going to do it here as Boston, they head to, they head back home. They'll take on Utah for Lafayette. They will head on the road next weekend as they will head up to Holy Cross on Sunday. Well, that's going to do it for John Sabino, our director, and our entire crew here from Fisher Stadium in Eastern Pennsylvania. I'm Mike Ventola saying so long as Boston University, they defeat Lafayette by a score of 13-9. to You've been watching Patriot League men's lacrosse action right here on ESPN.